Hello. Welcome to French Horse Beer Review. I'm Scott. I'm Jeff. And we're back again today for uh, another review. Um, we have uh, a beer by um, Ale Smith in conjunction with Pizza Port. They're both out of California. This is their triple IPA. 10% alcohol. Can't beat that. Um, I've had it a couple nights ago. Excellent. Great hoppiness and zero alcohol finish. It's pretty fantastic in my eyes. Yeah, I went a little earlier uh, before we recorded it. And I was blown away by how I could not taste uh, the, uh, the big beer that it is in a little can. Not a ton of maltiness or that thickness that you get from a, uh, a strong beer. It was really good. So these go for, uh, what did you pay for a six pack? Six pack of cans, $14.99 at the local, the local shop. Which isn't terrible for the strength of it. I've paid uh, more than that for less of a beer. So. Yeah, when you think about it, it's pretty much a 12 pack. Because at ten percent, yeah, um, pretty much like buying a twelve pack, which you can't get for cheaper than like fifteen, sixteen bucks now. Yeah. If you're buying good stuff, right? Or so, halfway um, decent stuff. Mm -hmm. Good, uh, good color on that one. Nice, nice clear golden. Yep, yeah. keeps a good head. Nice head. It's always important. Uh, again, great glassware to get your nose right in there and smell it all. Smells like an IPA wood. Mm -hmm. Very hoppy. It tastes so good too. Uh, did you pull off any of the hops out of this? I want to say there was. See, I, I get the, I get the citrus. The pine. I don't taste a ton of pine. No, but I mean, this is the guys making it that are describing it, so I'm sure they're pretty accurate. Yeah. Maybe like resinous almost? Yeah, yeah. No mango. Um, no, I don't get a lot of, uh, not a lot of tropical stuff going on. Yeah. But um, dry finish, that's accurate. That's what I like though, I like a dry finish. I don't like uh, a sweet, sweet back end on it at all. It's really <laughs> sweet back end on it. It's not <laughs> But good solid beer. It's uh, it, it's one of the better beers I've had in Hard to believe. Away from the standard uh, stuff. That much alcohol in this beer. Uh, the video might suffer because of because of that, because we had one before, but um, I, I'm blown away. Yeah, one of, my, uh, one of my new favorites, but I can't afford to drink it all the time. My liver, nor my wall. Yeah, I'm gonna, um, I, this is uh, up there with anything I've tried at this percentage. Oh, usually oh, far and above, I think. Usually a beer at this, uh, this alcohol by volume, you can taste the booze a lot. Y you start getting into that almost uh, barley wine kind of yeah. flavor to it or taste to it, which yeah, it's a tough one. Tough one to do. Yeah, I still feel like it's an IPA, and not just uh, yeah. some over the top big beer to see how much alcohol they could cram into it. Yeah, it didn't lose a lot of what an IPA is, what it should be. Um, we got to thank you guys for uh, watching the videos uh, last week. We put two up last week and uh, got quite a bit of views and we have a few subscribers. Yeah, we're going to try to get it a little more consistent now, maybe maybe twice a week, maybe three times a week, depending how much we can do. Uh, we're both pretty busy most of the time, family and stuff, so yeah. we'll keep see what up, we can uh, do. Keep yeah. up the likes and... Uh, you know, spread the word. Yeah, tell people to subscribe. It's, you know, something fun to watch. So. Yeah, so, um, uh, we're gonna do a caveman review. Okay, go ahead. So, for a caveman review for this one, I mean, uh, here we go. Mm. Good stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> and uh, 
my review out of five is uh, I give it four and a quarter. I think it's outstanding. Um, uh, I'm right there with you. I can't. I mean, if I had to go, could go any more, it wouldn't be much. It yeah, make a difference. But four and a quarter is pretty, pretty. Yeah, it doesn't do anything crazy, but the fact that it's able to hide that ten percent, right, and still tastes like a normal IPA to me is yeah. really uh, unbelievable. Item. Excellent. So, um, yeah, this one is called Logical Choice Triple IPA. Um, six pack, 12 ounces. 15 bucks. 15 bucks or so. It's definitely worth the money. Definitely worth a try. Share it with some friends. Yeah. Don't drink the whole six pack in one night. No. No, it's trouble. Exactly. <laughs> Cheers, my friend. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Thank you.